SpaceX, led by visionary entrepreneur Elon Musk, continues to push the boundaries of space exploration with the development of the Starship spacecraft. Following the success of the initial test flight, the anticipation surrounding the second flight test of the SpaceX Starship is palpable. This article delves into the details of this momentous event, exploring the advancements, challenges, and the pivotal role the Starship plays in the future of space exploration. The SpaceX Starship is a fully reusable spacecraft designed for a variety of missions, ranging from crewed missions to the Moon and Mars to the potential for interstellar travel. Conceived as part of SpaceX's ambitious plan to make life multiplanetary, the Starship is a key element in Elon Musk's vision for the human colonization of Mars and beyond. Subscribe to the official channel of Technology Space. Visit their channel page and click the subscribe button and press the bell icon for more new updates. Test flight objectives. Suborbital hops. The primary objective of the second Starship flight test is to perform a suborbital hop, similar to the first test, but with refinements and improvements based on data gathered from the previous flight. This involves a controlled ascent, hover, and descent back to the landing pad. Advanced maneuvering. The second test aims to showcase more advanced maneuvering capabilities, such as controlled lateral movement during the descent phase. This will be a critical step in demonstrating the spacecraft's versatility and precision in navigating the complexities of re-entry. High altitude ascent. Unlike the initial test, the second flight may involve a higher altitude ascent to test the spacecraft's performance under more demanding conditions. This will provide valuable data on the aerodynamics and propulsion systems during the critical phases of flight. Starship Prototype The second test will likely involve a new prototype, incrementally numbered, reflecting the iterative development process characteristic of SpaceX's approach to spacecraft design. Each prototype builds upon lessons learned from its predecessors, technical advancements, Raptor engines, the Starship is powered by SpaceX's cutting-edge Raptor engines, designed to use liquid methane and liquid oxygen as propellants. The second flight will showcase improvements in engine performance based on insights gained from the first test. Thermal protection system, the spacecraft's heat shield, crucial for protecting it during re-entry, will likely feature advancements based on the thermal loads experienced in the first test. This iteration aims to enhance the integrity and efficiency of the heat shield. Aerodynamic design, refinements. The second test will incorporate refinements in the aerodynamic design with adjustments to control surfaces, flaps, and other features to improve stability and control throughout the flight profile. Landing leg deployment. One of the key objectives is to test the deployment and functionality of the landing legs during the descent phase. This is a critical element for ensuring a safe and controlled landing, especially as the spacecraft evolves toward orbital missions. Flight timeline, pre-launch, preparations, prototyping, and assembly. Prior to the second flight, SpaceX engineers would have completed the construction and assembly of the new Starship prototype. This involves integrating the Raptor engines, avionics, and other systems into the spacecraft structure. Ground tests would include static fire tests of the Raptor engines, ensuring their performance and validating the spacecraft's systems in a controlled environment. These tests contribute to the overall readiness of the spacecraft for flight. Launch sequence, countdown, and ignition. The launch sequence begins with the countdown, leading to the ignition of the Raptor engines. The spacecraft is secured on the launch pad as the engines roar to life, propelling the Starship into the sky. Ascent phase. The Starship ascends into the atmosphere, showcasing the power and efficiency of the Raptor engines. The ascent phase allows engineers to monitor the spacecraft's trajectory, aerodynamics, and engine performance in real time. Maneuvering and control. During ascent, the spacecraft may execute maneuvers to simulate real-world scenarios, testing its ability to respond to changes in trajectory and environmental conditions. This phase is crucial for evaluating the effectiveness of control systems. Hover and descent. The spacecraft reaches its peak altitude, hovers momentarily, and begins its controlled descent. This phase involves testing the spacecraft's ability to transition from the vacuum of space to controlled flight in Earth's atmosphere. Landing sequence. As the Starship descends, the landing legs deploy, 
and the spacecraft makes a controlled landing on the designated pad. This aspect of the test is crucial for assessing the precision and reliability of the landing system. Post-landing operations. After landing, the spacecraft undergoes post-flight operations, including data retrieval, system assessments, and a thorough inspection to inform future design iterations and improvements. Data analysis and iterative design telemetry and data retrieval. Throughout the flight, the spacecraft transmits telemetry data back to SpaceX Mission Control, providing real-time insights into its performance. Post-flight, engineers analyze this data to assess the success of the test and identify areas for improvement. The second flight test contributes to SpaceX's iterative design process. Lessons learned from the first flight and the second test inform subsequent design iterations, guiding engineers in refining the Starship's capabilities for future missions. Spacecraft testing, especially with cutting-edge prototypes, presents inherent challenges. The second flight aims to address and overcome operational challenges, such as navigation issues, communication stability, and system reliability, weather and environmental factors. Weather conditions play a crucial role in launch decisions. Adverse weather, including high winds or storms, could impact the scheduled launch. The team must monitor and account for environmental factors to ensure a safe and successful test. Safety protocols ensuring the safety of both the spacecraft and the surrounding environment is paramount. The test flight adheres to strict safety protocols and any anomalies or deviations trigger automatic abort sequences to prevent potential hazards. Public and regulatory considerations. As SpaceX continues its ambitious endeavors, public and regulatory considerations come into play. Transparency, adherence to regulations, and effective communication with stakeholders contribute to the overall success and acceptance of the Starship program. Future implications and beyond. The second flight test of the SpaceX Starship marks a crucial step toward the realization of Elon Musk's vision for interplanetary travel and the colonization of Mars. The iterative design process, informed by data from each test, positions the Starship as a versatile and reliable spacecraft for a range of future missions. Mars colonization and interplanetary travel. Crewed missions. The Starship is envisioned as the spacecraft that will carry humans to Mars. Successful test flights pave the way for crewed missions, opening the door to the possibility of establishing a human presence on the Red Planet. In situ resource utilization, ISRU. The Starship's cargo capacity facilitates the transport of equipment for in-situ resource utilization on Mars. This includes technologies for extracting and utilizing local resources, making Mars missions more sustainable. Interplanetary transport. Beyond Mars, the Starship could serve as the primary interplanetary transport system, enabling missions to other destinations in the solar system. Its versatility and reusability contribute to the feasibility and cost-effectiveness of ambitious space exploration endeavors. Lunar Exploration and Beyond Artemis Program Support The Starship is a key component of NASA's Artemis Program, which aims to return humans to the moon and eventually establish a sustainable human presence. The spacecraft's capabilities support lunar exploration missions and the construction of lunar bases. Gateway Construction Starship's cargo capacity facilitates the transportation of components for building the Lunar Gateway, a space station orbiting the moon. This infrastructure will serve as a staging point for future lunar and interplanetary missions. Beyond the solar system, the Starship's potential extends beyond our solar system. Its robust design, advanced propulsion systems, and reusability make it a candidate for future interstellar exploration, opening the door to the possibility of humanity venturing beyond the confines of our local cosmic neighborhood. In conclusion, the second flight test of the SpaceX Starship represents a pivotal moment in the evolution of space exploration. As the spacecraft undergoes increasingly ambitious trials, the data gathered and lessons learned contribute to the refinement of its design and capabilities. The successful development of the Starship Starship holds the promise of reshaping the future of space travel, making interplanetary exploration and human colonization of other celestial bodies not just a dream, but an achievable reality. With each test, the SpaceX Starship propels humanity closer to the realization of a multiplanetary existence and the next era of space exploration. A heartfelt thank you to our amazing viewers and supporters of Technology Space. Your enthusiasm for space exploration fuels our passion.
We appreciate your continued engagement and look forward to bringing you more cutting-edge content on the wonders of technology in space.